I'm not sure why my phone stopped recording. I think I might be out of room or something. Uh, this is gonna be just a continuation of the last video because... Okay, I was basically saying, okay, this long ass article I found, um, randomly stumbled across when I was Google image searching Jamie Hewlett, okay? Um, basically, long story short, I'm not going to go into this entire article, um, because it's really fucking long, uh, and I know I have the article link somewhere in here, um, but I can't copy-paste and I'm a fucking idiot, so I'm just gonna go off memory. Um, so basically this article, um, and this is just all context for what I'm gonna say in a minute, um, there's this guy named Banksy, uh, who's an artist, street artist, um, in England, we don't, uh, nobody knows who he is, and, um, there's this article that basically saying that somebody was looking into all the companies that were associated with this artist, and basically they're owned by, um, Jamie Hewlett, and, uh, basically that this artist is probably Jamie Hewlett, and, um, so I made a post on Instagram, okay, because it's like a joke, like, who is this guy, right? So there's a hashtag, who is Bonzi, okay? And, um, I made, I made, a, um, okay. So basically, I just took a screenshot from this article. This is the post. I will read it. I will read the post. It just says, he used to sell prints to other street artists. Pictures and Wells Limited is owned by Jamie Hewlett. Therefore, it seems Jamie Hewlett is the ultimate beneficial owner of all Bunksy corporations, so he, if he isn't Bunksy, he must be very close to him. Complex Magazine has also previously confirmed that Hewlett is the main shareholder of Pictures and Wells. Okay. <laughs> now, <laughs> I'm not confirming any connection here. This has, literally has nothing to do with this post. Because I was getting away from posting political shit so I could find, and I did post like a funny picture of, I did like do a fun edit of Jamie Hewlett, but you get the point. I was getting away from posting political shit. I was like, I'm gonna post something funny, so I posted this, and the hashtags were, guys, I swear if, well, this was the co comment on the post. Guys, I swear if this isn't some giant troll, Adam Hewell is trolling us this whole time. Hashtag who is Bonksy, hashtag Jimmy Hewlett, hashtag memes, hashtag Illuminati, hashtag Illuminati confirmed, hashtag conspiracy, hashtag LOL, hashtag curious, hashtag street art, hashtag article, hashtag coincidence. <laughs> So I made this dumbass post, okay, <laughs> and, um, this post currently has 91 likes on it. <laughs> guys, guys. Okay, L literally... Okay, this account now has 502 followers. I followed a bunch of prof professional artists. I was reading Jamie's post about abortion, and I was reading some of the comments, and there's this female comic book artist, um, Tula Lode, and she commented on it, and I thought that her art was amazing, and I followed her, and now, um... She, um, actually, um, liked my, um, I, I told everyone to go follow her on my Instagram, and she has a tick next to her name. She has 55,000 followers, and she liked my comment, and, and, um, liked my tag thing, okay? And when I told her art was good, she, she had thanked me, so I had a person with 55,000 followers thank me for the compliments. And, uh, for perspective, let's see, uh, Jamie has, um, uh, how many followers does Jamie have? He has 370,000, so that's a lot of followers. Um, oh, this is my backup account. I guess I'm not following him on my backup account. But anyway, um, so, um, basically, um, and no, he didn't acknowledge, like, like, he didn't acknowledge my existence or anything, but the point is that I made these posts, and either inspired by or relating to him, and for some reason, I got so many likes and so many follows off of it, because I followed a bunch of, like, professional artists, and I'm like, are these people, people who are fans of these artists, they think I have clout, they think I have connections and clout, 
I have gotten a fair bit of spam messages as well. I've gotten shit like, here, here's this smartphone you can get. Like, fucking shit, I don't care. Uh, even though I still have a fucking iPhone 4, but you get my point. Um, literally, oh my god. Like, literally, I cannot believe how many people are actually following me. My art is shit. I do post art on this account, and it's not good. Okay? <laughs> like, literally, I want to draw like these people, but my art is shit, okay? And I just don't understand why anyone would want to follow this account. It's just not good. It's just a bunch of spam and hot takes and angry rants and opinions and shit. And somehow somebody decided to follow this account. 500 people decided to follow this account. And I'm just so grateful. I just can't believe that so many people actually want to follow me or look at my posts. Like, I just don't understand. Like, literally, so many people, they think this is, this conspiracy is so funny or so interesting. Um, it just, it's not even a, it's not even a fucking conspiracy, guys. It's true. It's fucking true. <laughs> but anyway, um, but going back on that, it's, it's, the art itself is political, not, not, not his Instagram art so much, but, um, I'm sorry, I'm, it's just guys, guys, if you know anything, again, if you don't know about this shit, just Google it, um, just Google, uh, Longsy and Jamie Hewlett, just Google it, I am literally can't do this anymore, I'm just, <laughs> guys, how on earth? Why do you all want so much? Like, just, I literally don't understand why you all like me so much. I'm so eternally grateful for all the support, um, on my Instagram, on my accounts. I am so fucking grateful, guys. I just, ugh, why? Like, literally nobody should like me. I should have, like, ten followers. I, wow. Wow, this has been insane. This conspiracy has been fucking insane. These followers have been fucking insane. Everything is insane, guys. I'm so grateful that you guys helped me get followers again on Instagram. I'm just so grateful. So anyway, guys, that's probably about it. That's most of the tea I have. I don't think I have any other tea um but yeah so that's about it um i this was a really long well this is part two of a really long ass video i'm just gonna upload them at the same time i guess and this is completely unedited unscripted this is just me rambling you know fucking shit whatever so um yeah guys if you if you watched the whole video thank you again sorry about the profanity sorry about the hot takes sorry about swearing sorry about screaming sorry, sorry about opinions and shit but i this is the real me, and if you don't like, if you don't like me, then don't follow me, like, literally don't subscribe. If you don't like me, unsubscribe from my channel. If you don't like the real me, if you don't like my opinions, that's fine. You don't have to. You don't have to like my opinions. You can unsub. I'm not offended. I, I would rather have honest people who actually like me for who I am and not people who just pretend just like this, like, false image of me, so, yeah. I am... Yeah, that's about it, so I, I guess I'm done. Bye.